It was interesting. I was born in 89, so I grew up in the 90s when Medellin was the most dangerous city in the world. And now things have changed. Medellin, nicknamed the city of eternal spring. A city known for its music, museums, nightlife and friendly people. When you hear about Medellin, some will think about the drug lord Pablo Escobar. And yes, it happened. But most Colombians don't like to talk about him. In fact, they hate him. And things have changed a lot since. It's a lot better now. Please forget about Pablo Escobar. Today was time to check out Medellin solo. How much do you think I can get for $10 here? I started off with taking a 15 minute bus drive for 2,000 Colombian pesos from the outskirts of Medellin to downtown. As always, the street art is on point here in Colombia. My big disadvantage today is I don't have any local guys with me, so I might have to pay overpriced for some of the things. So keep that in mind when you watch the video. It might not be the best deals I get. Let's see. Guama. Yes. Believe me when I say you can't go to Medellin without trying a guama. But please don't eat the big seeds inside, they'll give you diarrhea, I was told. Interesting food. You only eat the white, you don't eat the black. While I was walking around Medellin to search for lunch, I saw lots of obvious Catholic people with a black cross marked on their foreheads because of a specific Wednesday called Miércoles de Ceniza. Should I get one? I don't know. Anyway, lunchtime. Aros carnes and a mandarin juice and some Colombian company. Seven thousand five hundred Colombian pesos. I can't leave this lunch place without a pasta bun. One of my all-time favorite sodas. You need to try pasta bun. I love you. Coming from Europe to South America, you'll need an adapter and maybe you'll need an extra smaller one like me. Two thousand five hundred Colombian pesos. Always good to have. I honestly think I had an ice cream in every country I've been to. An essential part of traveling, right? One thousand five hundred Colombian pesos. So nice. I would say don't trust what the bad news that you hear, you know? You have to come here and see it for yourself. It's actually a really great place to live. People are the friendliest you ever meet. The guy who sold me this told me the name was Mango-ish. And don't worry, Colombians are not so scary. Colombians are friendly people. 2,500 Colombian pesos. To be fair, I didn't really like this one, but I'm sure someone will like it. It's very bitter. Amigo, you want this? Naranja punch juice. Yes, one is not enough. I need two. 2,000 Colombian pesos. I have bought so much and I haven't even spent six dollars yet. That's incredible. Colombia is so cheap. So I agreed with myself I needed to splash out big time now with buying a Colombian ring. So fancy. 4,000 Colombian pesos. I needed to try a manzana soda also to compare, but it doesn't beat pasta bun for sure. It's good still. 1,000 Colombian pesos. Bandera Paisa, Colombia's national dish. No way I could finish this video without trying this. Traditional Colombian food, 10,000 Colombian pesos. And included in that price was three drinks. <laughs> For less than three dollars? Oh my god, amo and, Colombia. Uh, is it uh, expensive here in Medellin? No. Cheap. <laughs> that left me on 14 amazing things in Medellin, Colombia. And remember I was without a local friend so I might have paid overpriced for some of the things. Cheap anyway. Muy bueno. I really like this colorful and cheap country called Colombia. Yes. How did you like Medellin? <laughs> <laughs> I really like Medellin. Have you been to Colombia? Please comment below. Colombian people are just really friendly. Remember to subscribe to Gus on the Go. 150 countries and more to come. Colombia! Colombia!